We're going to make some cornbread. We're going to use meal and flour, a cluck nugget, and some milk. You want two cups of meal. Roughly a cup of flour. It's usually two to one ratio, but I like more meal, so I add more meal than I do the flour. While I'm getting ready, I'm going to put some oil in this skillet, and I'm going to put my stove heat on about a medium to get this to heat up while I'm doing the rest of this. I'm going to put one cluck of nugget right in this bowl. Then I'm going to put some milk, and I'm going to stir. I just incorporate so I finished off. off the batter with water you can finish it off with um, milk if you want to but so I like to use water get, get a good consistency and all your lumps is just about out of it at that point your skillet should be nice and hot and should make a frying sizzling sound this makes a thick pone of bread so if you don't like it thick, you need to make less. You just have to play with everything. Now we're going to put that in a 400 degree oven. So we go to some chicken liver, chicken liver. And we're going to wash that chicken liver pretty and clean. Now what we're going to do is going to put some flour. And you're going to season it with salt and pepper, paprika, onion powder, whatever you want in there. That's just my preference. We're going to get our skillet good and hot before we put them in there. So we test it, see if it's hot. Yep, see it frying there. You can see it rolling. You're doing what you're supposed to be a doing if it's a doing that. At that time, you know it's good and hot. You want to turn it down on a medium-low heat because you don't want them burned. And then uh, put them in there. Be careful. This pops and will splatter all over you. Then I put some vegetables in this hair cooker, some mixed vegetables, and I'm going to use this cheese sauce on it. Coat it real good. You don't need no milk or nothing. Everything's already in that jar, and you just heat them up. I got some cooked taters back there, and here you go. There's our meal for today. Good eats.